So good morning, good afternoon, good evening, everyone. Um, I'd like to delve into the ethos that guides our institute. What is an ethos? Well, the ethos of our organization serves as its moral compass. And we aim to clarify, I aim to clarify our guiding principles and core values. Now, the, the logo of the GCTI, GCTI, Global Counterterrorism Institute, it serves as a visual articulation of the organization's core values and missions. At the heart of design is a shield, a symbol that encapsulates the principles of unity, perfection, attention, and protection. The shield serves as a reminder of the collective endeavor to maintain global security and the meticulous attention to detail required in counterterrorism efforts. Dominating the background are the citadel and pillars, which stands as metaphors for a stronghold, learning, and fortress. Now, these elements signify an institute's commitments to being a bastion of knowledge and a fortress of security. They, em they emphasize the importance of educational rigor and the unyielding strength required to combat the ever-evolving threat of terrorism. Now, central to the logo is a book, an enduring symbol of knowledge, education, and wisdom. This element underscores the Institute's dedication to continuous learning and the dissemination of expertise in the field of counterterrorism. It serves as a testament to the belief that education is the cornerstone of any effective strategy to combat global threats. Encircling these elements is a wreath that signifies communication, globalism, and teamwork. The wreath serves as a reminder that in an interconnected world, collaboration and global communication are not just beneficial, but essential. It emphasizes the importance of working in unison across borders and cultures to achieve the common goal of global security. Now together, these elements coalesce to form a logo that is not just a visual identifier, but a narrative. Encapsulating the multifaceted approach of the global counterterrorism towards achieving its mission. And what is that mission? Well, the mission for us is the cornerstone of our institute. It defines our purpose and sets the direction for our endeavors. Our vision, it's aspiration. It's what we aim to become, a global leader in counterterrorism studies. And how we, how we look at those are our core values. And, and the six core values are the pillars that uphold our institute. Let's explore each one in detail. Integrity means adhering to ethical and moral principles. It's crucial for maintaining public trust and internal cohesion. We have some real world applications within the Institute for this. Excellence, well, it's about setting high standards in research, education, and operations. It's what sets us apart. Collaboration involves working together internally and externally and to achieve it, our mission. It also amplifies our impact. Respect is about valuing diversity and treating everyone with dignity. It's essential for a harmonious work environment. Innovation means embracing new ideas and technologies. It keeps us ahead of the curve in counterterrorism strategies. Responsibility is our commitment to ethical conduct and social betterment. It's how we contribute to global security. Our guiding principles, well, these principles guide our actions and decisions, ensuring that we remain aligned with our mission and values. What are those guiding principles? Evidence-based approach, a global perspective, sustainability, community engagement, and lifelong learning. Our code of conduct is non-negotiable. It's the rule book that ensures we operate within ethical and legal boundaries. What's that mean? Well, confidentiality and data security, fairness and impartiality, and reporting misconduct. So in summary, our ethos is the backbone of our institute. It guides us as we move forward in our quest to improve global security. What are the next steps for our organization? We'll discuss that in the next leaders meeting and uh, with a webinar coming up.